uh, and like VOD stuff. So, uh, Carflow Dill, uh, see ya. All right, I was gone 30 seconds and already a very strong start for Carflow. Yeah, Carflow's pressure is insane today, and I just haven't seen uh, <laughs> Dill. Dill just kind of pulls stuff out of her ass, uh, and I haven't seen, like... Respectively. Respectively, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so I'm waiting to see. Like, Uh, yeah, I mean, this is, like I said, like, uh, on paper, a matchup that uh, is kind of leaning towards Roy, but, no you doubt. know, uh, is, is also a character that can get gimped. Uh, so, like, you know, Rob has an amazing offstage game. And, ooh, don't great touch me. Out. Don't touch me. Wow. This nice. was, like, a great response to 100% unanswered. Yeah, nice double-edged dance, doofus. <laughs> and then gets up smash. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so yeah, Dill, Dill, uh, <laughs> he just runs into it. He knows it's coming. Oh, uh, by the way, uh, for anyone who hasn't seen, oh, uh, di in that was a little, yeah, really tough. for anyone who hasn't seen John Numbers' uh, anti, anti Rob Tech video uh, on like how to pick up the gyro, please go watch it. It's on his YouTube. You can probably just search it up on uh, like John Numbers YouTube or whatever. I watched it and I I can't remember it still. Basically, like the moment you initiate dash and you hit A, you will pick up the gyro no matter what. Oh, okay. Like, there is no way to fail this. You just need to buffer the A after you do the dash, and you will pick it up mid dash. It is like oh, without even doing an air or a dash attack. Yeah, you just pick it up. That's crazy. Yeah, you don't need to pick it up with a with a move. You just pick it up. Wow, jab back here at 80 on this stage, even on a big body like Rob. That's crazy, as well. Uh, oop. Gets the nair confirm. Uh, Carflow opted to do a beefy up B, or just like lean back a little bit to avoid maybe a down air. Uh, but Dill was right there, able to respond to landing that nair. Carflow getting a little bit trigger happy with some of his get off me options. Both fighting for center stage, both last stock, both at like not unreasonable percents. I don't know. Dill's a definitely a kill percent for a side B at this point. We saw Jab back air kill at about this percent also. Up till proper D. Uh, maybe question mark yeah. What's up? And side B takes it. All right, I'm uh, still consistently making me eat my words. I keep saying she's playing poorly, and then she keeps using winners finals up a game. Uh, maybe that just goes to show how high of a regard I hold her in. I don't know. Yo, what's up, Steve? What's how you doing, man? What's poppin'? Cinder, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Cinder. Yeah, thank you, thank you. I see you on stream all the time, man. Good I, stuff. Uh, well, it's been a minute. I haven't, <laughs> I haven't come here in like a month and a half. Hey, listen, from what I've seen on stream, you've been killing it anyway. Thank so. you. That's what I'm talking about. Fill me in. What's going on? Well, we got car flow up. Or, oh, no. We got Dill up 1-0 on Carflow. Carflow seems like playing hot as hell today. Dill, I thought, was playing, like, slow. She's mm -hmm. still tired from run and shine with Devin. I expected a little bit. like, and, and it is still kind of deflated play, but she's still just winning. Yeah. She just wins, and you don't quite notice how it happens sometimes. I mean, that's also the key to playing Rob. You just got to win. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, there's nothing particularly unreasonable that she's doing. I'm not seeing anything that's like, ugh, Rob stuff again. <laughs> it's like, oh, suddenly Roy's dead. Of course. I mean, um, like, there's a lot of advantages that this character definitely has, especially over Roy, I want to say. Like, with neutral air as it is, like, come on, that's such a good tool to use. Yeah. And we're seeing a bit of that right now for Bill. But I don't know. The pressure that Roy can put on is really strong against oh, yeah. uh, Rob. Because Roy I like is this. fast. Yes. Certainly. He's fast, he swings, and he kills. You know, uh, they used to say Roy's our boy. This Roy's a man. <laughs> like, yeah, I'm telling you, Roy's the man now. Yeah, he, he, you know, he says stuff with his chest. Yeah. Oh, not quite. All right, I think Dill was maybe DIing up to get out of that. Um, yeah, I like this stage pick by Carflow. Um, 
not enough room for uh, Dill to set up shop with anything. Uh, heckling on the platform seems like it'd be good. Oh, okay. I like the potential cross up out of that. Like, did you notice? Like, it actually did impact through like the midsection of Rob. Oh wow. Uh, yeah, the hitbox is gigantic. Oh my god, Carflow dies. Carflow. I can't tell if that was an SD or if that was just really. Yeah, I think he was like fastballing to get out of the way of something, uh, <laughs> and that ended up costing him a stock. Okay, up B. A lot of mileage out of this up B. It's really yeah. Like Rob's shield pressure, the frame data is insane on down tilt. Uh, so it is a good call out option. Mm. Just like once you've been down tilted twice, like, you know what? I'll just throw this up B out there. Usually it lands. You know, it, it, it's, it's kind of reminiscent of a sure you can. So it's like, is Roy yeah. a Shoto is the question. Oh, is Roy alive is the question. Oh, yeah, we live barely. That. that was a funny side B. It reflected the gyro and caught him up, uh, almost killing him. Yeah, I tend to forget that gyro uh, does get reflected, let alone most things out of uh, Rob's side B, because it's like you don't really see it used too often just as a reflector, yeah. but when it happens, it happens, man. Nonetheless, Carful is staying alive here. Let's go. Putting on some damage. It's like too committal to use as a reflector. Oh, yeah. So Especially because of the startup sense. on it, too. Yeah. Startup and the, yeah, the, the end lag of it. Uh, all right, grab. Let's see what's going on here. I don't, I don't know, man. Like, people are still not. They got to watch the John Numbers video. Like, 77%. <laughs> you shouldn't get hit by anything out of Barry. You're out and you air dodge out. That's it. True. It depends on how hard you mash, too, because it's either you mash and you get up aired or you don't oh. mash, you get up smash. Oh, my God. That was such a smart conversion. <laughs> wow, that's Carpo insane. Carpo knows the method. He knows the, the properties of gyro, which Devin's been back here actually teaching me oh, yeah. the intricacies of. There's, oh, my God. Nice up smash. That hitbox is gigantic. We are swinging, and I'm happy about it. Oh, yeah. I love games where people box like this, especially when it comes out of Rob and Roy, two very prominent characters on the scene, I want to say. I mean, this is also a great stage to do it. There's not much room for anything else. Oh, yeah, you have to. You have to. This, this is the boxing ring. I know we got that as a stage, but this is the real oh You're God. here. You're sharing an expensive-ass <laughs> studio apartment in New York. You're in close quarters. Yo, Tom Nook? You're throwing fists. You know yeah. the rent's going up every Animal Crossing like game, right? Yeah, he's the slumlord. <laughs> I don't know what the square footage on this stage is, but... It's not great. It's not enough for This is a Manhattan people. apartment. Yeah. <laughs> Too real. I'm over on the Upper West Side. God oh damn. my god. Not my best call. <laughs> Listen, you gotta talk to Rob because in situations like this, I feel a robbery coming along. You might be able to rob an apartment. Yes, sir. I don't know. These are <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, the stage spike off of the gyro? Still alive though, These no technique. They're both thieves though. They're, you know. Oh yeah. They're no stranger to the streets. They're throwing fists and they, they know how to steal shit real early. You would think this is like winner's finals. It feels like a hood classic to me. <laughs> oh my god. Should yeah. be seeing this on Worldstar right now. Oh, this oh, is no. crazy. Give me that. Well, Jack on the hand, quite. still alive. Wow. I don't know what's going to happen. Really? A lot of things. Oh, no, oh. I see it. Yeah. I don't even know. If, it might have been Sus DI again. I thought they'll DI in one of the updates before and killed pretty early. Mm hmm. Yeah, but it was like the very last hit of Royal B2 because that is the one that matters the most. Yeah. Man. Like the tail end. It's, it's like, yeah, it's like uh, Ken Shore you. Oh, yeah. See? Let, re, Roy's a Shoto. Yeah, yeah, no <laughs> doubt. Roy's a Shoto. Fight me. Fight me. We got no Tatsus. Actually, neutral neutral air on Roy and all the other Fire Emblem characters, that's a Tatsu to me. <laughs> I'm going to say that. I'm going to say that. It looks like a Tatsu and it hits twice. Man, Come on. Giving a projectile Look at that. Like Look how good that move is. Roy would be crazy. Look how good that move is. Look, uh, last hit. Look at the shine. Look at the shine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That friend right there. Twing. I think that's mostly because Rob that? is just big as hell. Come on, man. You didn't see the little sparkle on that? I did, yeah. That's you asking for trouble. <laughs> You're asking for trouble. I'm telling you. That's like a, one cool thing about this game that they did is uh, when you fully charge a move, the character, like if you look at their portrait, they get a little twinkle in their eye. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, yeah. That's, a, that's a really cool thing. Uh, that's kind of like also Meta Knight. Whenever, uh, whenever you parry in this game, the character's eyes turn yellow. Yeah, but, Meta Knight's but, full turn red. Yeah, full red because it's like you won't know otherwise, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, that's, that's all of them. They all turn red, but it's just Meta Knights are so big that you can see it. No, no, they all turn, they all turn yellow, but Meta Knight's or, eyes yeah, are yeah, already yeah. yellow. Yeah, yeah. Oh, but they're already... Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, I understand so they, what they you're saying. They turn a different now. color instead. Okay. Super okay, special. Okay. But this isn't about Meta Knight. This is about Roy and Dill. Car flow, Roy and Dill. <laughs> I can't pull Rob, Rob. It's just Dill. Um, man, some of these close range scraps are getting a little bit weird. Like yeah, uh, a that. lot of like, like I don't know, close range Nair into like spot dodge, Z drop, gyro. 
The shield pressure gets weird here. Yeah, you're that, scared ooh, of Roy. Get that off of that. Oh my god. So early too. That kill was in about 40 seconds. Yeah, that was in double jump range. That was. Man, he put on so much damage so quickly. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised because they were both sort of boxing this entire time, but. The damage deficit, I didn't really see that coming. Kind of misses the forward I air there. I love the enthusiasm from Dill, honestly. Oh, yeah, because at that point, you got to go for something sneaky early because you're you're only giving Carflow extra credit anytime you get hit at this yeah. point in time. So. And he's been taking the opportunity to, like, he fast falls to get to his, like, to get low enough to avoid getting hit. Mm -hmm. uh, but if you go down there with just, like, one lingering hitbox and, and hit him, just like with a Falcon Knee equivalent, he's, he's out of jump and he's too low to recover. Oh, yeah, he dies for that. Um, Recovery so far, doesn't no quite feel like damage, but I got you. Oh, you dead off of that? Nice. Bad DI. Straight, straight up. Yeah, Dill kind of had that one secured in the bag from the first hit. So this is a good recovery so far from the first stock. Up bears, keeping this lead going, extending a little bit. Yeah, that was an uh, oh, excuse me, that was an interesting interaction. I thought Carflow was going to keep the combo going, but if you notice, uh, he spent the second jump right before hitting the platform. And normally, like you could obviously reset jumps on there, but it looks like uh, that jump might have come out a little too early and couldn't mm. extend the combo fully. But nonetheless, not too far behind now. Loving the neutral. Oh, okay, eat that gyro. That's so fast. Oh, the read, but rolling <laughs> out of there. Oh, excuse me, I'm over here. <laughs> Lots of rolls. Yeah, wow. It seems like where we're seeing Dill most comfortable, maybe not even by choice, but is like with a little bit of space further closer to the ledge. When we're seeing close range stuff at center stage, there's a lot of weird spot dodgy rolly scraps going on. It turns into a bakery. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if the rolls are good. They might get a little stale. I don't know. It's but... <laughs> like they're working. Oh, that's going to oh, be that. Oh, no, that sucks. Dill was just a couple of frames off with that side B. That's unfortunate. Because Rob is like kind of minus after after you with that, so you know, big yeah, punish opportunity. Yeah. Oh, get off me! All right, Barry? down throw. Let's, Let's see if he gets the match. Oh, yeah, he, oh he, my he God! No way! That sucks. Dill could have had that kill there. Up air definitely would have gotten rid of that stock. Well, that's for what sure. you're supposed to do is mash out and air dodge immediately. Oh yeah, oh not yeah. Not a not a real confirm out of that until like he's got another twenty percent before you got to really worry. Would you say neutral air dodge or directional? Um, directional is just a better thing to get you out of the mix. Up air is just a, a lingering hitbox that could, you know, it only matters that you get hit with the last hit anyway. But. Yeah, yeah, true. Because, like, it does combo into itself, of course, but, like, I don't I, what, I don't think there's a lot of probability of somebody falling out of Rob up air, right? Wouldn't think so. Not a ton. Yeah. Um, Carflow's been using Gyro so effectively this whole set. We've seen a bunch of kills. It's uh, not even his. Not, <laughs> I know, yeah. <laughs> this, oh, okay. Is this going to be a kill this time? Jump up air? Oh, no, just up smash. Nice. Yeah. I don't know. If he wanted it more, he was out of that. He was safe. For sure. Like but that thing, I feel like that Rob Barry is like 50-50. It's like, you got to guess, are they going to mash? Are they not going to mash? And what do you do after that? Ooh, nice slam. And so Dill has a better opportunity here. Yeah, but Dill's playing the hell out of this neutral right now. Yeah. It's crazy. We're getting, getting some percentage straight hits, Properly spacing aerials. Oh, what? What was that interaction? What? Yeah. Man. Nah, that was a robbery. Carflo's Are you just been getting me? so much mileage off those upbeats. <laughs> no I want to say like 20% of the damage of the entire set were through those upbeats out of shield. That's crazy. That's crazy. Guy hit with gyro still gets the upbeat out of it because yeah. that has armor on it, right? Because yeah, it's the only thing because the gyro is going to hit you. Like if you challenge the gyro, it's going to hit you. I don't know. Maybe he was throwing it so it wouldn't. But like, <laughs> um, it just went clean through it and got the kill. Was a I, was robbery trying, and a hat, I was trying though. to make a play with more knowledge than Devin had given me, but I've got it mixed up. <laughs> I'm learning too many things. I finally learned what Rage Drive was called tonight. Oh, did you? <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's okay. Don't I, worry. I know all the things.